Hello, my dear friends, this is Goxter with the second part of my conceptual thoughts about atheism. In the last part, so I leave the link here below for those who don't have watched it, I left one reflection out. And this to leave you the time to comment on my basic statement. But now I will give you shortly this supplementary statement. Aggressive atheism contributes as a competing factor to religiosity. From the Four Horsemen only two are very well known and many of the most loud and popular atheist YouTube channels are absolutely in the way of those two horsemen. I want to take a look at the less popular of those four horsemen on Daniel Dennett and Sam Harris. This with a question for you. Where are the popular YouTubers speaking about philosophy and neurology? Popular channels for me are those with a subscriber base of over 5,000 subscribers and more than 2,000 views per video. You can suggest me a few if you know if there are. Meanwhile, please take a look at Michael Payton 67 channel and especially to the video under his channel link here below. Here you will also find my approach to active atheism. This is a channel where I learn a lot from. Maybe you can stop this video and come back afterwards for commenting on my video here. A second channel and mostly a serial of videos of a speech from the astronomer Dr. Philip Carey Plate, which I found on the channel Dawkins, Dennett, Hitchens, Harris, which out without vowels, uh, please give you the time to listen to this conference speech and also here I leave the link below. I know that even if we call us free thinkers, skeptics, most of us are influenced and by publicity and uh, propaganda. Our soap culture is trained to listen more to those who are the loudest and not always those who are the most rational. It needs also much more learning, a bigger investment in time to follow such theories, who goes out of the only two pillars, uh, cosmology and biology, where most of the popular YouTubers build their fame. Many of these popular and even populist channels are repeating all along the same mantra with only a growing routine like every church preacher who has to memorize only one book. Well, <laughs> that said, I want you to watch two more videos to show you a little more what I mean. The first one is a really brilliant video from The Laughing Out, link below. And the second from uh, the atheist Jim Underdown, who was invited for a dialogue at the Moment Church in Irvine. I found this on the channel The Good Atheist, link below. Please feel free to come back after watching my proposed videos for your comment here. But this only if you were ready to quit path of being a sheep and follow only the loudest yellers. The next and last video in this row will be about how I mix Taoism, Buddhism and hedonism for my life philosophy. Yeah, this was Goxter, caress you and thank you very much.